back to my channel so today i am blessing y'all with my first ever natural hair video oh my gosh i'm excited but i'm trying to keep calm so as you can see i have my dry dirty product filled here and i'm going to kind of like pre-poo i guess i'm just going to put in some leave-in conditioner and wet it with water and try to detangle my hair so it's easy for me to wash and i'm just going to section those off into four parts with my hair clips after I've done that, I am going to wash my hair. You guys have already seen what I do to wash my hair, so I'm kind of going to rush through that a bit. And I did have a guest at my house, so I couldn't like go into the kitchen and wash my hair. So I basically just give you guys a brief overview of you know what I do to wash my hair. As you can see, the difference with it being all tangled and stuff like that. So as you guys already know, I use the Aussie Moist Shampoo and Conditioner currently, and you want make sure you wash your hair with the pads of your hand and not so much as your fingernails so basically what I'm gonna do for this video is just a quick shampoo and conditioner I did not deep condition or do my oil treatment in this video but I will have it in a separate video for you guys because this is a quick wash and go routine so after I've done with that and I've washed it out I'm going to go in with my Jamaican black castor oil with peppermint and this basically promotes healthy hair and scalp, revitalizes, help prevents itchy scalp, which I do have, and moisturizes and softens cuticles. So what I'm doing right here is just, I applied a little bit on my hands, mostly on my fingertips, to try to get it to the root part of my hair, just so I can get it on my scalp. And then I'm going to go in with my olive oil and my Cantu argan oil leave-in conditioner repair cream and that basically moisturizes and protects hair from damaged from damaged hair and heat and stuff like that basically um, you can use this for three options and that is for daily styling a leave-in treatment and a frizz free hair I mostly use it for daily styling and leave-in treatment especially when I don't do like my deep deep condition routine so basically what I'm going to do is section off my hair and this is how we're going to get or defined curls and this is the finger coiling method I usually use the LOC method, but in this video, I'm going to be using the LCO method. I wet my hair with water, I apply my leave-in conditioner and my oil, and then after that, I am going to use the gel to help curl my hair, and I'm going to comb that out a little bit. As you can see, you know, I'm just showing you guys how my hair is with all the products and stuff like that and it's kind of moisturized it's pretty moisturized you know my hair turns out pretty black and shiny to be honest which i kind of like i will say in this video i did rush it this was one of my quickest and ugliest wash and goes ever but when i mean you really like this is a legit wash and go like it's a wash and go so after i have applied my gel in my hair i am going to start to do the finger coiling of my hair and that's basically when you take a piece of your hair and you wrap it around your fingers that's basically how it looks i will have a in-depth clip of how you do it basically you guys gotta have strong arms for this because what i mean your arms will hurt your arms will hurt but yeah, I am totally loving Be Natural. I love my little teeny weeny afro. And oh my gosh, I don't want to love it too, too much. Because I kind of want it to grow. But you never know. I may just end up keeping it short. But yeah, this is basically what I do for my wash and go.
this video I kind of touched up my hair a lot while it was wet which you should not do so some of mine came out a little bit frizzy plus I kind of did some of my curls curl strands really big because I was rushing but that's basically how my curls are and stuff like that when I do the finger coiling method this is the next day and I'm just taking my bonnet off and as you can see my hair looks flat and ill-shaped as ever so basically I'm just taking some of the black castor oil and I'm just tapping it into my hair you know giving it some more added shine and then I'm going to use a comb I don't have a pick but it's kind of like a pick and I'm just going to pick my hair starting from the roots and kind of like pull the ends a little bit to kind of shape my hair how I want it to and get some of the curls you know standing off and looking like it's popping out of my head <laughs> so that's basically what I'm gonna do you know shape my hair however I'm not going to do it in any style right now because that's just more time and all I'm gonna do is just lay my edges a little bit because you cannot have a hairdo and not lay them edges so for my edges I'm using the flaxseed and black castor oil eco styler gel and on my handsy dandy tube brush and I'm just going to lay those edges and that's basically it for the video I want to thank you guys so much for joining me and I will see you guys in my next video don't forget to stay positive and anything you can imagine is real so go for it okay dream big and go for it thank you guys so much for watching I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video bye <laughs>